Hey guys, what's up? It's been a while. I know, I've been just very, very busy with school lately. It's been crazy. I'm like going nuts. I'm, act I'm actually insane right now. So um, I apologize I haven't been able to make a video, but uh, this is like the first moment I have found to do so. So I'm going to go ahead and do a book haul for you guys. I have a ton of other videos to catch up on, but I have no idea when I'm going to be able to do those. So just bear with me here, and um, I will try to do a video whenever I get the chance. Um, luckily, this weekend hasn't been very busy, so... Anyway, I've got about 12 books to show you guys. This is all from the past month, so... Uh, it's just been piling up like crazy, but... Uh, got Fault in Our Stars by John Green. Of course, of course, this is a signed copy. Um, yeah. uh, no Hankler fish or anything. I have been fishing for one of those lately, but I can't find one. But, uh, can't wait to read this. I would have read it by now, but like I said, I've been really busy with school, so I haven't gotten the chance to read it. So I've just been trying to avoid as many spoilers as I possibly can. Um, I also got Emily's House by Natalie Wright. I won this in a giveaway from the author. Um, she has a YouTube channel, and uh, she was posting the giveaway for this, and I can't wait to read it. I've heard a lot of good things about it on uh, Goodreads, and the author seems really, really cool. So thank you, Natalie, if you're watching this. I really appreciate it, and I cannot wait to read it. Um, then, in another giveaway, I won two books um, from Sarah Nicholas and uh, Kaylee uh, over at the YA Rebels. I think they're Saturday. You've probably seen them before. They're hosting a giveaway for four different books, and I won two of them. I got Paranormalcy by Kirsten White. I've been wanting to read this really bad, and I can't wait to dig into that one. And then I also won The Maze Runner by James Dashner. I should have read this by now, but I just haven't gotten around to it. So, finally have it. can't wait to start it. Um, and then uh, Sarah and Kaylee also sent me some swag. I got a uh, sticker for the book The Pledge by Kimberly Durding. And then I got um, a signed uh, book plate for the book Incarnate. Or Incarnate. I forget how it's pronounced. But I uh, can't wait to read that book. And now I've got a book plate to put in the front of it when I do get it. Um, and then I also got a uh, sticker for Incarnate also. And then I got uh, Desires of the Dead bookmark, which is, a book I think, book two in the Body Finder series by Kimberly Durding. Um, so I haven't read that series yet, but I've heard it's really good. Uh, then I went to Ollie's again a couple weeks ago, and I went nuts, as I always do at that place. I got Thirst, number four, by Christopher Pike. This was only $2.99. Uh, brand new book, and I've really been wanting to read this series lately, so now I have, this is number four, I also have number two and number three, so I just need to pick up number one, and then I can start the series. Uh, then I picked up Curse of the Wendigo by Rick Yancey, this is book two in the Monster Monologist series. I have been really, really excited to read this series, I've heard a lot of really great things about it. Uh, I'm a big horror nut, so of course I, I, I feel like I'm inclined to read these books. Uh, this was only $3.99. Uh, like I said, I don't have the first book yet, but um, I need to pick it up at some point. So when I do pick it up, I'll already have the second book, so I can go ahead and yeah, continue reading the series. Um, and then even though this is book three, and I don't have book one or book two, I went ahead and picked up Monsters of Men. Uh, this is, like I said, book three um, in the Chaos Walking series. Uh, this was only $5.99, and I've heard, again, awesome, awesome things about the series. Um, I, I'm going to try to pick up book one as soon as I can, uh, but I heard that if when you do start the series, you should have the other books, so that way you can just keep on reading them, and you don't have to wait to get the next book, so that's why I went ahead and picked up this one, so that way I already have it. Then I flipped out when I saw this book at Ollie's It's Graceling by uh, Kristen Cashore, I think. Uh, this was only $3.99, hardcover. First edition, as every single book I buy, they're always first editions, but uh, I've been searching for one of these for a long time, a hardcover first edition of this book, and I found it. Three ninety nine, perfect shape. I, Like I said, I flipped out. <laughs> I'm really excited to, to, to read that book. Okay, uh, then I have White Cat by Holly Black. Um, I really like Holly Black. I've only read uh, her Spiderwick series. I haven't read any of her YA books yet, so I'm looking forward to reading that. Getting only three ninety nine, and then I picked up Wildfire by Karsten Knight. Um, I've heard this is pretty cool as well, and um, 
the author has a YouTube channel and he seems like a cool guy, so pick that up. Three ninety nine. Then I picked uh, uh, The Talisman, Volume 1, The Road of Trials by Stephen King and Peter Straub. This is the graphic novel, and I haven't read the original Talisman book yet, but I've been wanting to. Um, so I thought after I read that, I could start the graphic novel series, because I do like graphic novels a lot, and I need to get more of them. And then today, I just got back from Half Price Books, and I only brought one book. I'm very, very proud of myself. Of course, I did buy two other movies, but uh, anyway... I got Nightshade by Adri Andrea Creamer, I think. Uh, I've been really wanting to read this series, as I have been wanting to read all these books. Obviously, that's why I picked them up. But uh, I heard that the third, the third book, the last book in the series, didn't end so well. But I went ahead and picked this up anyway, because it's a beautiful, beautiful book. And uh, I don't know, I just heard it was really cool. It's got the really nice deckled edges there. I'm sure everybody's seen this book by now. But uh, anyway, can't wait to read all of these books. Um, haven't been able to do much reading lately, but <sighs> there's just so much to read <laughs> any time. Uh, but anyway, you guys, thanks for watching, and um, I'm sorry if this video was rushed or crazy. Like I said, I'm crazy right now. I'm losing my mind. Uh, anyway, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.